Good morning, 8.43 a.m. I'm XRP Future Millionaire, and as you see, the markets have imploded. XRP is down 8.83% in the last roughly 12 and a half hours. Bitcoin's down over 7%, almost 7.5%, down under 21,500. And you have Ethereum down under 1,700. What catapulted the crypto price, well, actually, I should say what sank the crypto prices is the fact we've talked about the U.S. dollar currency index. The U.S. dollar currency index, in fact, broke all the way up to our 108, almost to the 109 target, but it hasn't gone up there yet, which gives me the fear now that if we do hold this 107.82, as I talked about yesterday, that we could have this nice parabolic spike up. I call this a inverted uh, W. Gartley reversal long ago. And we're way down here, and I said it looks like we're going to pull up Hold this as support, bounce up, hit the support here, break up, and then hold this as support on our way up to 109 spot 20. And then we'll see if we can get up to the capitulation style event up to 120. It's done exactly what we've stated. The total crypto market cap is down better than 6.4%, down 6.46% now, barely holding on to 1 trillion. The critical support levels we have around the area, we've already busted the support at 1.02. And when they start to roll back down like this, now the next level would be to retest this broken descending triangle if it continues to break down. That's a very big rising channel, which leads me to believe we can get back to $654 billion. We have, with XRP, we're at 33.76, down 8.73%. Before we go any further, if you could hit that like button, I'd really appreciate it. The likes have been way up. So all you have to do is look on my video from yesterday and then look in the video description below and you can see, you can join Tom's Army right there on the right side. If you would like to pay it forward for not only the call yesterday where we saved 10% on XRP, but just for the work serve, time serve style thing, if you want to pay it forward, you can click on the join Tom's Army. It's $9.99 a month and you get the exclusive telegram upon joining. There's 249 people in the telegram. And also, if you want to join me on BitGet, there's a partnered link right there in the video description that you can easily click on. Up until August 20th, you get 10% back. So up to $1,000, you'll get $100 bucks if you transfer from another exchange if you use my partnered link. Now, you can also trade XRP on BitGet. No VPN. They're certified through the states. So you can trade it, no questions asked. So what's going to happen today on XRP? XRP has come down to that uptrending support we talked about. This is actually a ominous time right here because this is where we talked about if this is an inverted head and shoulders pattern, it would have to come down to 3320, well, the 3313 support, 3324. And that's where we would get that hit. And then we could continue the inverted head and shoulders. It had to come down to this exact area though. That's why I targeted it yesterday. And that's why we knew where it was gonna drop today or yesterday. We just don't know how quick it's going to happen. That's why I don't like to give timetables. But it did exactly what we were talking about. And now for this bear flag, this can still have a rally now and make an inverted head and shoulder style pattern, assuming it holds this uptrend right here or the true uptrend just below it at 3173. Now, for this inverted head and shoulders to play out like I'm seeing, it would need to hold this uptrend. Otherwise, we can have a bear flag breakdown. And then we can continue down and this is nothing more than a fake out. And I would love this because if this is nothing more than a fake out, we're coming down here to about 1457 when this is all said and done, just based on this pattern we're in. So that's what I want you to see this morning. I want you to pay attention to this because it is absolutely vital because XRP is on this uptrending support. If we're going to pull out this inverted head and shoulders, this is where we would stop. This is where I targeted it. So... I want to know in the comments if you think we have an inverted head and shoulder set up and this was actually a bear trap and we're about to have a pump. Before we leave, I want to continue with our running series on Ripple. So how Ripple's CBDC platform works, and I'd highly encourage you to turn that bell notification to all. And if you would be so kind, share me far and wide on social media because I think the more people that could have watched these updates yesterday and the day before knowing that we were about to crash would make things a lot easier. As you know, we came out and said the busted ascending triangle in the short-term pattern would bring us down to the exact target we're at today. Step one, onboard. Standard APIs enable integration of the CBDC platform into existing systems. Step two, mint. 
Banks can use the CBDC platforms, cryptographic, multi-sign controls to mint CBDCs, distribute. Issuers can directly send CBDCs to authorized accounts, ensuring only valid participants receive and hold the CBDCs. Step 4. Transact. Transactions settle in 2-3 to three seconds across many use cases. Interoperability enables cross-asset and cross-border transactions when connected to another CBDC. Step 5. Redeem. Participants can return funds on the CBDC platform to the issuer in exchange for the fiat. Step 6. Destroy. The CBDC platform supports the secure destruction of currency giving the bank full control over supply. With Ripple's groundbreaking technology, we can experiment with CBDCs within our existing payments infrastructure while ensuring efficient and cost-effective cross-border transfers. And then you can always look at more customer responses. We help companies around the world accelerate their business. Together with our customers, we're moving money around the world instantly, seamlessly, seamlessly and cost-effectively. And then these are the companies they've helped out. Have a good day and I'll see you this afternoon or later this morning.